The story I'm going to tell today is a story that my sister and I begged my dad to tell over and over again. My dad was born in 1952 in deep East Texas. He was incredibly poor, lived in a shack, dirt floors, no refrigerator. Later in life, he and his siblings would go to live in an orphanage in Waco, but this story is from his beginnings and it's called The Traveling Seal. In 1957, I was in kindergarten. My school was having an assembly because a traveling seal was coming to do tricks. I had heard that the seal could balance a ball on its nose. The assembly cost a nickel to attend. Well, my family didn't even have two nickels to rub together. So when the teacher took the whole class to the assembly, she asked me to sit in the classroom until they got back. Well, I sat there feeling sad for myself for a bit, and then I decided to head on home. So I'm dragging my feet in the dirt in the street on the way home, and I look up, and there is my dad walking towards me. He knew about the assembly, and he was coming to get me. Well, all my sadness melted away as I walked side by side with dad in his work clothes. My dad leaned down and said, son, I am real proud of you for leaving that school and walking home alone. When my dad tells his story, we always exclaim over the injustice of all of it. The poor kindergartner sitting alone in the classroom, the school that had an assembly that cost money. Why didn't the teacher just give him a nickel? But when my dad tells this story, he has no sadness. He laughs all of that off because he is beaming with pride about the moment that his dad remembered him. <laughs>